Hello and uh, hello and welcome everyone to uh, another live stream. We are going to be streaming a very crucial game here, Team Pointers versus Fichki. Um, I'll be joining with uh, Gunlin and Terrify. So, and and the broadcaster for today is Versus. So, welcome guys. Uh, thank you, Defeat, for that lovely introduction. Um, I believe Terrify will be joining us a bit later on. But yeah, as you said, quite an interesting game. Two very tough teams today. We're starting off mm -hmm. with the map of Forest. Um, Defeat, would you like to introduce the players? Yes, sure. Uh, for team pointers, we have Sem Grant, Greg, uh, Shame, Immortal Hero, Dot, Dotty, and Ed. Um, we get, uh, and and for Fichki, we have Stella, Onyx, Bo Boogie, Freeze, Corvette, Fellow, and Maza. I mean, I think both teams have pretty experienced light format players. So, what do you think, uh, Jan? Who's gonna win? Um, I think it's gonna be quite a tough game. I mean. We know team points they've been playing with each other for many years and we see them play with each other for yeah. a lot. However, you know, Frischke have been quite surprising with their performance as well. I mean they've been doing quite well as well. Um they've very got their BPs are very strong with each other. Um Onyx especially. Yeah. Great communication. Look, mm -hmm. Look, Greg is double drops and he's got pretty high HP still and he's gonna be able to pull right here, I think. And if he gets out of the base, which he does pretty successfully, this means that nobody, like, they have to push on the right side to mm -hmm. try and counter this. Which is exactly what they're doing. We've got Corvette, Fellow, Maza, Onyx, all on the right, but with the support of Boogie Freezer, who's coming later on. Team Pointers might be in a bit of trouble. Can they get this capture? It, Maza, can he get out of that base? Oh, he is able to get out, but he's only one shot right here. Nice job. Sam Grand might take him out from the top, which he does. Onyx needs to drive. He's not seeing Totti. Onyx, lucky three shots. Wow, he got three shots, dude. Lucky, yeah. very lucky. Yep, SM Grand takes the double power and gets taken out immediately. So, this looks like a standoff. Greg might be forced to go back to the left side. It's interesting how both the teams have gone to play with two hunters, I believe. Um, in Forest, you know, we tend to see one hunter, but I guess there's right. been a change of tactics. Yep, uh, yeah, that is definitely interesting because... You're right. Most pe most teams have gone with that one hunter uh, combination, but here we're seeing Greg playing for Greg and Sam. No, Sam Grant's playing Wasp. Who's the other VP? Who's the uh, other hunter? Shame. Oh yeah, shame. And for Fishq, we've got uh, Stella and fellow on hunters. Mm -hmm. No, Stella's the uh, Smokey dude. Oh, apologies. Oh, so so Fishq are playing with yeah, Smokey Fishky hunter. Yeah, just playing with one. So, Fellow takes the DA and uh, he's pretty low on HP, although Greg is going to take his double drops and he's going to be full drop. So, this is this Can could be strong from Team Pointers. Let's see if Immortal Hero Dao, he, he, he's a very critical p position. He should have tried to still survive longer, but he's unable to. But, he but Greg, to shame, but Greg. Greg. He's got he's no support with him. Yeah, he's attacking himself. Yeah, gets taken out. If if he had someone camping on the left side, whoa! Can Buki Freezer get this? No. He does he does some good damage on that left side, yeah. but gets taken out. Um, Terrifier, are you here? Yeah. What's up, man? Hey, Sorry for joining in a late one, but looks a bit intense from the start here. Yeah, this is a very interesting game already. <laughs> Um, so both teams trying. DP. Yeah. Could oh, he leaves it. No, he leaves. Right. He does take it. Fellow takes that double power. Can Fichki make something happen here with Fellow on that DP? Still four shots. No one's taking right. him out. Stream is getting pressured right now. Got Stella as well. Stella and Mazda trying to pick up their DP. Fellow pushing with his DP. Can One this shot. Wow. He gets taken out. Can't do much. But Stella picks up the DP. Gets taken out by Ed. Great shot. Edgar probably going to pick up that repair. Yeah. What do you think? Do you think uh, Stella should have gone and helped out instead of waiting for the double power? Just gone and help for the um, return? I mean, uh, he kind of had to clear out all the players to get the DP because if if he didn't do that, then uh, Team Pointers here would have had a potential chance to deal some damage on Fichki. So I think Stella mm -hmm. did the right decision. Uh, double armor. I think this is going to be. A, they're going to be able to steal the double armor here, which is Great. good job by team pointers. Totti misses shots, but those, so does fellow. Very unlucky. Corvette's one shot. Totti. 
Totti one shot as well, Bookie Freezer two shots, and Bookie Freezer also got Muzzle with him, gets taken out. Yeah. That was close though. Look, Greg again taking his double drops, almost full HP this time again, but can he get help on the left side with someone attacking? I'm not sure what it is. Either Greg has to be more vocal or Team Point needs to start listening up to Greg when he's got his drops. Because, mm -hmm. he's again, he's not really got that much support. Ed's coming in a bit late with it, the smoke key. Yeah. You're right. I think Greg just... I, I don't know what... Because nobody... Every, the attack has to be coordinated. Otherwise, his drops are pretty much useless. Yeah, especially, especially in... For such a big map, like it's kind of closed off, so your teammate needs to kind of describe what's going on within the map for you to have understanding. Yeah. Double power here for Boogie. He's gonna be able to take it. Yep. And now he can try to survive for as long as he can. Yeah, Fiji are really struggling to control that double power there. Mm -hmm. Um. Now, uh, Fiji. Oh, sorry. Team Point is struggling. Sorry. And Fiji's yeah. double power is now dropping in their base. Probably Fellow or Stella is gonna pick it up. Ed yeah. tries to steal it. Oh, lucky. Yeah, Boogie Freezer has still... He hasn't died yet. And he's taken up doing a lot of damage. But Fellow got a shot off on Shame. He's now two shots, but Fellow gets taken out. Yeah. So I wanted to take a fag off of Shame so we can sell off and be four shots again. Yeah, because the double armor would be dropping soon anyway. Yep, and as we're talking about double armors, Freechki's double armor is dropping. Fellow's probably going to be able to pick it up. Be eight shots. He's got his speed dropping if he could wait a bit, but he decides n oh, he decides not to. Wow, why? I'm not sure. Maybe he's not quite aware of it. Um, on the other side, we're probably going to see Immortal get pressured by Fellow to, to pick up that D8. No, maybe Greg can make it. Well, great decision nice from Fellow. Great Boogie's decision. Boogie's going to return this flag okay, here, man. Wow. Boogie? Boogie gets the return. Wow. <laughs> wow. Sneaky, like... And Mazo gets the capture. So three minutes in the game, only left now, and uh, Fichki have the first lead. Do you guys think Greg can pull right here? Personally, I I don't see it happening. Ed's been lacking on support with Greg, and but he's currently the... pulling. He's currently pulling, but we've got Stella spawning. He's a bit solo one. though. No, Greg but... and the motor hero are there to support him. Greg, Greg can, can pick, pick this flag up. Yeah. We've got fellow Corvette and Stella going for the return. Greg only one shot. Immortal hero gets taken out. Wow. Corvette. Can Ed take a shot? Ed, Ed. take the flag. Ah, oh, gets taken out. Um, Great shot from Bucky Freezer. Returned. Yeah, that was a good job by um, Fichki getting that return. Otherwise, if they didn't allow, like, all four players didn't go for the return right there, that should have, yeah. could have been a capture. And on the other side, we've got fellow pulling now. Onyx camping on top with that double power, dealing as much damage as he can, takes yeah, out some grand. But look, uh, there's four players from uh, Team Pointers on the other side. They should be a, they should be able to pull. Mortal might pull this. He's got Greg on top. Some grand's also going to come for... Greg decides to camp with a DP. Was it a good choice? He misses his shot. Some grand's probably going to be able to pick up the flag. And Mazza's one shot, gets taken out by Greg, well done. Onyx is now going to pick up that DA because no hunters are around him. Yep. He's, although Fellow was coming, he was sort oh. of forced. Um, yeah. Now Shame's yeah. going to have his double armor, but he's ignoring it? Mm. He just doesn't want to get shot from Onyx. Guess, yeah. Which Onyx gets taken out, and he's probably going to pick up that repair and the speed to become eight shots. Nice. Kind of risky for him to do that type of jump, but no one was around him, so... Yeah. But Boogie team point is really This is their only chance. They have to help shame her. Immortal Fifth. hero now needs to survive. There's only 45 seconds left. Oh, this is good. The smoky. Ed, great Ed. shot from Ed. This yep. could be a return. Do we see a return? It has to be a yeah, that, that's yep. definitely a return. Nice. Sam Grand. No one's rushing Sam Grand either. Just Onyx from the top. He hasn't got time. Sam Grand's probably going to get to capture. That's 1 1. Wow. Hey. It's just proof like anything can happen in life. Hmm. I know that was just well played, like last cycle yeah. of shame getting support. Right. Fellow gets flipped, but yeah, I 100% agree with you. They played that last drop very well. Hmm. 
So if Greg got support like that, like two rounds earlier, he could have captured like three times, to be yeah, honest. Yeah. But returned three times. First round becomes a draw, and I believe we should be opening up the forms. Yeah. So guys, the forms are now open. Go ahead and enter your nicknames. The links in the description. We'll be picking winners after the second cycle. After the second round. Okay, so welcome back guys. We're going to be starting round number two now. Um, both teams are playing with the same uh, same players, it looks like. Yep, I agree. Okay, so the round has started and uh, let's see if, uh, which team can get away with three points here. If they, whoever wins this round will be getting the three points. Yeah, that's correct. Winner of this round, three points. Uh, double power dropping right now for um, Fichki and Semgrand and Ed right there with their BPs to steal that double power. So that's good job by them. And there's also a DA dropping on that base. Maybe Semgrand can stay alive. Stella flips. Semgrand can maybe stay alive, do some damage. Toy deals some good damage Ooh. on Fellow. He's only four shots with that DA. He's going to go for his speed. And Immortal, he's going to take the DP. He leaves it for shame, which can probably focus Fellow and take uh, Fellow wow. out in two shots. Ooh. Greg is pulling. pulling. Yeah, exactly. And he's got Ed to help out with the Smokey if he needs it. Stella's now two shots, one shot one now. Shot. Should be get taken out. Ed misses a shot, but Semgran takes him out. And there's DA speed down. Semgran is, is he going to pick it up? I believe so, because Corvette and Fellow are pushing him. Someone needs to pick up that speed, so it's time for the next cycle. Oh, is that lag? No. Fellow? Uh, fellow? Get... No, is there only one shot? No one picked up that speed, but this should be a catch for team pointers, regardless. Yeah. Nice. One, no, one no to team pointers. And that's super important. In the first cycle, they're able to control the drops, and like it all started with the double power control that the yeah. BPs did. So. Exactly. They then they took out the hunter on the other side. Yeah, very well played. <clears throat> Yep, this goes to show how important BPs are in light format game. Like, you really need your hunters to have support from your BPs. Yeah, 100% agree. So, yeah, I mean, team pointers with the lead first for the first time in this game. And 
now they're they're gonna uh, be able to continue hopefully the attack and keep, uh, keep applying that pressure on on Fichki. I mean, this is a pretty good game, pretty intense so far. Maybe Onyx can go for a sneaky flag. Oh, but he takes a shot and misses. This yeah, gets taken out. No much. Guys, the on. form wasn't open apparently. That um, I thought it was open. Can someone check? Fellow picks up his DK, but he's only one shot gets taken out. Um, again, the same cycle of drops are happening. Uh, so the DA got taken out, and now it's... Maza, is he going to be able to steal it? No, he doesn't. Import Immortal takes the DP with Smokey. Onyx, no. Stella decides to take him out. And it should be Team Pointer's DA soon, which is exactly what's happening. Okay, Fellow will be able to pull right here, I think. Yep, no one's on that left side for Team Pointer's. The fellow will easily be able to pull that. Greg's also on DA speed. He's going against Corvette. Corvette gets taken out. Boogie Freeze are Onyx and Maz on the left to deal with Greg. Fellow with his Nitro is so fellow gets fast taken. now. Ferrari. Yeah, exactly. Shame and Totti. Can they return? Maybe Shame is three shots. Corvette needs to be careful. Ooh. Why? That's close. Greg makes Boogie miss. Very well played by Greg. Can Ed pick up the flag? Ooh, Onyx makes him miss, but she's got the support of Toy and Shame. Toy picks up the flag. Is Corvette going to get the return? Corvette gets the return. 1-1 one, wow. one for Fichki. Wow. They are no... They don't want to lose this. Looks like they're, they're playing yeah. very well. Yeah. Very well from both teams. Not trying to make too many mistakes. Well played by Greg there, but couldn't get away. Okay, so let's see if, if uh, team pointers go more aggressive because we saw them get the... And they're trying to do that again this time. Sam Grant can yeah. pick up that double power. Third time, but Corvette is going to be able to pick up. Wow. Corvette picks it up this time. Well done to Corvette. However, look, they're still pressuring that DA. And is Shame going to be able to pick it up? Nice and he job. He does. He does. Well done to Shame. Maybe he can start something with Ed and Sam Grant on the other side. Also, Greg coming. Totty, he's got a DP behind him. He decides not to pick it up. He's one shot, but Corvette's going to be able to sneak up and maybe take it. Ooh. Oh, that was not smart by Tati. He let Corvette basically take that double power. Yeah. This could be bad. Corvette's with that DP camping, fellows with that speed. However, team pointers have their DA dropping. Mazda ignores up. the double armor. Oh. Mazda decides to pick up the DA and obviously we've got fellow pulling. He's still three shots and he's got a speed. No one's pressing that is, much. This is good. This Only Greg good. there and he Greg's also one shot. Greg's one shot. Shame has a bit of time. They need to get three accurate shots on Fellow. Fellow's speed runs out. He's two shots. He's one shot. This might be a return. Oh, Ooh, Onyx spawns on Fellow. Shame's going to be able to pull out maybe. He's one shot. Wow. Great focus. So Great focus. That's, that's, that's definitely Stella, Stella. Can he get it? <gasps> Stella. Nobody noticed. Stella makes Ed miss. Wow. Get Stella just made. Oh my god. Very well played by Stella. Oh my god. Stella. He won. Boogie? Boogie gets oh, the get Wow. That was very. Yeah. Stella. Stella played amazing there. He made two players miss. I believe it was Totti yeah. and Ed. Both. Wow. That was, that was such a good job by Fichi, dude. They were down in the deficit in the early part, and now they're playing as if they're like champions or something. Corvette's pulling again. Corvette is putting Shamed on top of him. He's probably going to get taken out. Ooh, he's one shot. Boogie Freezer, ah, a bit too late. A couple seconds yeah. too late. The DP's dropped, the DA's dropped. We need to see these drops being taken. Greg, is he going to be able to steal it? Oh, no, man, that's his one. Boogie Freezer pulling again. Totti's on top. He's not going to pick up that DP. He hasn't got time. He's got to deal with Boogie Freezer. Boogie decides to go the other way. But Greg and Totti are there to deal with him. Stella's going to take out Totti. Can Stella look at the flag? Oh, Greg gets the return. On the other side, we've got Shame pulling. Potentially. Mm -hmm. Gets supported by Ed. Fellow's going to take him out. Fellow's one shot. Ed's not going to... Ed gets it. 
Wow. Boogie Freeze is there to deal with him. However, Sam Grant's there. He's got support. Ed's got support. Wow, he gets taken out. This very looks good. pretty promising. Yeah, it's oh, very, very... On the left side, though. Ooh, the left side. Onyx, Fellow, Stella, Boogie Freeze, and Mars is coming from the back as well. Totti gets taken out. Maybe he should have camped. There's a lot of players on the left. Corvette trying to do some sneaky movements, but Greg's eight shots, seven shots. Can Greg carry team pointers to a capture? Takes out Boogie Freeze up. Greg gets the capture. Mm -hmm. Two two. Two two. This is if they so end strong up... for team point, but yeah. like now, whichever team wins gets to keep. Greg may be getting away with a sneaky flag. He's with his speed. Stella and Onyx are on him. He's getting quite far. He's in his own base now. We've got just Corvette on the left. Not much pressure going on from Freech Key. Shame on the flag. Four shots. Also got the support of Sam Grand. Two shots. Shame. Is this going to be a capture? Pokey Freeze. I guess so. Corvette <gasps> gets taken out. Wow. This should be Corvette. a return. Corvette gets the return. Wow. Now maybe, maybe Freech Key are going to go for a pull. One minute left. Don't forget guys. Yeah, fellow's got the double armor too to help Totti's out. Totti's behind I mean. him though, to deal with him. He's only one shot. If Mazza can have a look at Totti. If Mazza can shoot Onyx. Totti. Onyx, nice. Onyx. Mazza misses his shot, but Onyx gets the kill. And we've got on the other side, we've got Sam Grand and Ed potentially pulling to Greg, which is four, which is four shots. Yeah, Greg should be able to pull regardless. But Onyx, look at his speed. He's got... But can they focus on Greg somehow? Greg's one shot. Tati one shot. This is a return. Or Red gets it. Wow. Free to Freech Key. Very well played. Well deserved as well. Both of the teams both of the teams played very well, but Freech Key comes out on top. Potentially gonna grab the three points in the next fifteen seconds. There shouldn't be much that happens. Wow, that's such a good round. Like the the way Feech Key played, and I'm sure Team Pointers will be so disappointed with that result. Of course, they also played yeah. very well. I didn't see that many mistakes occur on the map. Yeah, definitely such an intense round, though. I believe we should be moving on to setups now, guys. Yeah. Um. Okay, so there was an issue last round, but the form we did open it mid round, and a lot of people did put their nickname so we're gonna open um, we're gonna pick winners now and then we're gonna open it again so so yeah, yeah the winners list should be on you guys' screen pretty soon Yeah, so congrats to Benefactor, Aguicho37, Caustic. Congrats, guys. Um, shout out to Benefactor and for being so active in the chat as well. All right, so we're going to open the form again for whoever missed it last time. Go ahead and enter your nicknames. And guys, we'll take a break and we'll be back when we start round three.
What? Hi, right, welcome back guys. We're going to be streaming round number three now. Um, rounds three and four will be in setups. So we've got a lot of different players. So I'll just quickly introduce Team Pointers. Gunlin can introduce the other team. For Team Pointers, we have Sam Grand, Immortal, Hero Dao, Tima, who is King of TP, Avitis, Mergalian, Pap, and Mr. Wanka. Um, currently for FreeShQ, we've only got five players within the map, but that's Maza, Flora, Stella, Parliament, Onyx, and Scooby Dooby has now joined. So, uh, guys, just to remind everyone who is just joining us for rounds one and two, we had um, Fichki take the three points. It was a very close game. The first round was a tie, actually. The second round was a 3-2 win for Fichki, but with that, they were able to um, <clears throat> get three points, the much-needed three points that they were looking for. Now, they have the lead. Um, I mean, they already have secured those three points, but they'll be trying to do a good job and setups as well but team Dev, pointers have a very strong team man yeah they've self just now but i just wanted to point out it's very interesting how mr buck has decided that um he'll be playing uh with the fire alteration on hammer the burning alteration whereas scooby db has decided to go with slugger so we'll see how that how that um helps or you know doesn't benefit the team all right so the run started and and what do you think about the combinations? I think there's nothing too surprising. Everyone's pretty using pretty standard equipment. Yeah, yeah, I think it's a standard cross out. I mean, you know, we've got the yeah. one short range playing, and then everyone else, you know, with their normal yeah. conversation com com combinations. There Both teams using a Vulcan though, which is not that surprising. I think it's pretty. We've seen yeah. that in forest multiple times. Yeah, I think it's controversial to play Smokey or Vulcan, but I think after the recent update where Smokey's kind of sh delayed shots, um, Vulcan ha is better than Smokey, but I do like the skin a lot. Of Smokey. Alright, Onyx trying to pull, but he's not going to be able to, for sure. Um, both teams might be content. I mean, setups can go slow if both teams end up defending, you know. It's it's super hard for the enemy team to, to pull if both teams are focusing primarily on defense. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see how how team pointers play. They're probably going to be aggressive, is my guess. Mas is taking the flag, but I don't think he can do much. He's surrounded by three players. However, Flora and Scooby Doo are pushing that right side to maybe potentially help out. But Bap, though, I think he can. Oh, never mind. Um, it looks like uh, team pointers aren't playing with the Nisida, although uh, Fichi no, are. I believe they are, I believe they are, I believe they are. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, Immortals playing Nisida. Yeah, I realized that later on as well, so they're playing with two short ranges, which is, you know, it's different. Mm -hmm. Scooby has pulled all the way back, and now team pointers need to figure out if they can pull. I mean, well, Parliament and Stella right there. We've got Avetis and Sam Grand versus Stella right now, but Avetis might get taken now. And he does. That this should be one nil. Wow. You know, I was really not expecting this. I mean, I thought team pointers could really control the map. Mm -hmm. That's what I think everybody expected, given the sort of legendary players that they have on the red team right now. But I mean, that's a good start for Fichki. They've already got the lead, and they they're showing that they're not bad in setups either. So it's interesting. Um, I can't quite tell what exactly is missing. I mean, I feel like the communication is there. Look, you've got, again, Avetis and Mr. Ranka pulling. Could this pull get somewhere? I've got Immortal Hero trying to get to them as well. Onyx is going to block them, though. Immortal Hero deals damage. Yeah, I think this is looking good. Team Tima needs to control somehow on the left side, but he's going to be there by himself. Avetis can come help out. Maza's also coming sneaky. Flora from behind as well. This is going to be close. I think this should be a cap though. Yeah, 1-1, one, 1-0. One, 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 oh. Interesting. Yep. Yeah, this is sort of what you expected from Team Pointers though. And let's see if they can keep this up. Um, controlling their left side while they're pulling. And uh, just you really just need communication, right? Yeah. It's, it's interesting how um, also one this difference I see is um, how Immortal... Hero decided not to take an alteration, whereas 
um, the other is Siddha of uh, Fridjki, which is Mwaza, this has an alteration on, so we'll see which is what's more effective. However, a motor hero has collected more points, meaning that it mm. could potentially be more efficient and effective. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it'll be interesting to see how the next five minutes play out. Actually, there's six minutes left. <clears throat> But both teams sort of def defending right f as of right now. Immortal hero kind of sneaking, but he's dealing with Stella. Um. Yeah. I mean, I think now Scooby is going to pull, but he's like super low on HP. Yeah, has no chance. Mister. On the other side, we've got Mr. Yanko versus two players, so he won't be able to do much. Stella selfing, so he just refreshes his drops because Flora is going to push that left side soon, and so we're going to need a def new defender, which will probably be Stella after he selfed. Some grand self, too, so I mean, this is smart, but look, Onyx and Maza, if they attack together with Maza the Isida, but I think they got spotted and got taken out. So I think Team Pointers really need to play more. Uh, you know they have, they've got more to lose. Um, right. They they're currently down three points, so they weren't able to pick that up. And so they should yeah. want to dominate in setups. However, you know even if they draw this round and win the next one, it'll be fine for them. But they should really be yeah. pushing for that win. Oh, uh, Mr. Wanka actually can pull right here, but he's alone again. And look how many defenders go back helping defense. So there's no chance. Pop is for... a bit slow to support him. Um, yeah, he's, he uses it. Oh, Onyx is pulling, but yeah. He's taken out. He, he should use some fire protection as he's playing like the Ricochet, which should be the main attacking uh, player. Yeah. And he's facing... I was looking at the... Uh, yeah. What I was going to say, I was looking at the best points table, and, and it's pretty much between five teams still that are in the mix for qualifying. So nobody is sort of guaranteed yet, although team mm. pointers are pretty strong. The majority of the teams that qualified do, you know, have a very strong position. They're a strong clan. It's the top. It's the best top eight clans that have qualified. Of the uh, Onyx, Mr. Vanka has pulled, and Onyx is right there. But wow, he gets support from the Sida, and this should be a capture unless Parliament Onyx. can go cut. Parliament's there. Scooby Doo, Mazza, Stella. Can they do something? Wow. This is very close, and he gets returns. Stella returns the flag. That I'm was a Barbie not a... girl. Um, I don't know if you're muted, dude. Pulling right now, and he's not able to pull. Um, but that was a very good effort from Team Pointers right there, though. And they're pulling again. Mr. Wanka has managed to pull all the way back. This should be a capture. There's literally no one who can help out. So, yeah, with that, Team Pointer is about to win. Oh, wow. 2-1. Three minutes still left there. Anything can happen. Now we need Fridge Kids to start playing more attacking. You've got too many of their players on the left. Stella, the Parliament, Onyx, Flora. Four players on the left. Stella's trying to cut in. I think now Fridge Key are in trouble because like they don't have that much time and team pointers can easily just go on defense and not allow anyone. I mean, I think that's exactly what they're doing. There's like four of their players in defense right now. And they're constantly selfing to refresh their drops. I don't think Parliament should be going left anymore. Like, yeah, really, honestly, I think they should just leave it to whoever spawns to defend. Yeah, now. yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. They've got to nothing them. to lose. They've got nothing yeah. to lose. And you really need a coordinated good attack from multiple directions. Exactly. Um, to really put that. I mean, Team Points are doing a very good job. Look how many defenders they've got. I mean, a couple of them self too. They play Sam Gran and Tama self. Is this going to put them in trouble? Can Mother do anything? He's still I don't know alive. Why he's at, I don't know why he's attacking solo as an Isida. Like, he needs to coordinate it with someone else. Um, Stella is not going to be able to pull either because there's just so many players. Um, 
Although he's trying his best, but there's just nowhere to go. I think Maza should just wait for his teammates. Like, there's just no point going solo every time. And back on the side, maybe. yeah. But Team Point is putting on some pressure. Parliament's run out of his DA, so Pap should take him out, which he does. But Flora and Stella have come to the left side to potentially deal with Pap and Mr. Vanco. They're just trying to take as Stop. much time as they can. Yeah, they're just trying to stall. Yeah, I mean, look, there's only 30 seconds left, 40 seconds left, so I don't know if there's enough time left in the game. Freechki are in trouble now. But Mazza, 20 seconds. Well, if he can pull, and, and they just need to control the left side, but there's nobody getting good spawns on the left. Stella and Flora are going to go help out. Onyx going to control the top. scooby Doo ignores Tema, which could be a mistake. Oh, 40 seconds. Uh, I don't Has know if Tema there's time. Oh, no, there isn't. There isn't. Look, no, no, Team Point is going to be able to pull up. and Yeah, Team Point is pulled out. Well played. Well played. So, first win for Team Pointers in setups. Now we're going to go ahead and pick winners for the second wave and then we'll open the form again, guys. So, the winner should be on your guys' screen soon. Alright, so congrats to Pokey971, PSCLLE31. Congrats, guys. And we have opened the form again. Please go ahead and enter your nicknames. And we'll pick winners after round four. Hi guys, uh, we're back with a fourth round setups again. Just starting off, so team points is won the last round, meaning that if they either draw or win this round, they pick up three points, and there'll be three points for both team. Now we've got Stella pushing Sam Grand and Avetis, but it should be dealt with. But however, we've got a much more coordinated attack coming from Mazza and Scooby Doo. Maybe something can happen. We've got Temer in the back doing some damage to Mazza, but Scooby Doo's going to decide to pull through middle. He's still full off. Mazza decides to block. The fire, which is the correct thing to do. Mr. Rankai, meanwhile, has pulled through the middle. It's, it looks yeah, like a standoff. Nice. <laughs> Eminem style commentating. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm joining soon. So, I mean, yeah, this, this round, as you can imagine, uh, team pointers are in the lead. So, you'd expect them to be more defensive? What do you think? Um, yeah, as they are in the lead, like, anything, I mean, anything can happen because Freechka have been playing very well as well, but I think to dominate on setups, everyone's predicted that uh, Team Pointers could win. I mean, Team Pointers are the team favourite. So, 
so yeah team and stella it's a, it's a stand off that we're in and looks like it's going to no no one's really pushing unless maza can uh, nobody's really pushing from either side onyx is pretty safe and so is mr vanka flora though but he's all by himself so isn't going to be able to do much Yeah, I mean, in a standoff in forest in setups, especially, you really need at least three players um, to attack. M at minimum two, but yeah. ideally, you need. I mean, to circle around. Yeah, like the most common standoff position is the one that we're in right now, where they just circle around the house. But is this going to be a return? Scooby is trying to go to the left side. No, he's surrounded. Yeah, I mean, that was a good push though from Fichki. They're playing well, they just need to hold on to if they get a lead. But look, Moss is in trouble, he's in trouble. He's getting chased around, mm. but but he's still in trouble, Scooby. Mm. He, will, he will be able to help him out. Seven minutes left, so there's a lot of time in the game, but... Um, they need something, uh, a good coordinated attack together, and it will work for them. I mean, but. we could be going on right now. Parliament, Maza, and Stella. Pa Stella's going to get the return. Parliament gets Parliament returns the flag. He's going to be a capture. I believe it is only Tema up top, but he's not got enough time to get to Onyx as he's just a firebird. Onyx gets the capture, one nil to Fritschki. I mean, good good start from them. It's not GG yet. <laughs> but. Excited, but we've got another push going on from Team Pointers, Mr. Mr. Banker and uh, Pap. Mm -hmm. And if they if they control the map like they are right now, that would be good news for them because you know they're now playing a little more defensive with two players being on the left side already. Um, Taking care of the attackers who will be attacking from team pointers from the left. So, so uh, let's see if uh, the team pointers play. Uh, like you, as you can see right now, Mr. Vanka and Immortal and Pap coming in as well. Um, trying to pull, Mr. Vanka has got the flag. Onyx is the only one that they need to take care of. Actually, Parliament's going to be able to pull this. And uh, wow, this should be a return from Avitis. If he gets the return, this should be a cap. Wow, nice job by Team Pointers. Equalizing one one. it at one. Avatis had literally zero HP when he returned it, and if he didn't, if he hadn't returned, that would not have been a capture because uh, Fichi would have managed to pull it. But that was very well coordinated, and they got the return and the tie. So. Yeah, we're back to where we started. So, you know, as long as Team Pointers get a draw, they still pick up the three points. Pressure is back on Fichki who are pulling right now. Stella and Maza right there. I mean, the uh, only person they need to take care of is Mr. Vanka who's no repair either. This is so strong from them. Stella drops the flag and uh, yeah, it's a good move. Onyx should be able to, but look, they've that bought in enough time for Immortal and Avitis to pull this flag. Onyx has nowhere to go but to run back and Mr. Vanka is going to be able to, can he get the return? Yes. But Stella on the other side is going to be able to pull again. Wow, this is, this is so, he's got nowhere to go. He's getting surrounded. And Mr. Vanka doesn't have a repair but, Pap, Pap gets, gets the a return, return. And Avatis is going to get the capture I believe. Now Fridge here in trouble. We need two flags and I just don't know if it can happen. Two flags, four minutes versus one of the strongest teams within the setup format. We can pull right here though. I mean, if he gets the pull and a quick cap right here, and anything can happen. Say take on Mr. Vanko. You control Mother the left side. 
Maza decided to sell probably to get a good spawn and potentially help Scooby Doo. But he doesn't, he spawns up top. Gonna try block pap. Avetis is on the other side is pulling with Immortal Hero. Maza now trying to deal some damage, but he's not gonna be able to return. Three plays from team pointers there. Yeah. As soon as they started pulling, they should have tried to control the left side, but unfortunately yeah. for them, they able to. Very unlucky. Yeah. There's enough time still, but I don't know if it's enough time for two flags. Just three minutes left, and, and two flags in, in seven. Forest is just a bit unrealistic. Although they just need one quick flag, and then if, if it can happen quickly, they can probably get a second one. But they're just not in good positions, to be honest. Very spread out right now, and only three players on the map anyway. So. Yeah, don't know if this is gonna work out. Mazza's attacking by himself. No one to help him out. Stella's without drops. Still picks up the flag. He's in a bit of trouble, I believe. I'm not sure if he's got drops. Oh, he does, he does. He, he uses his yeah. DA now. Sam Grand just putting some pressure, putting him in the open, but Stella gets two plays around him. That's spawn. Yeah. Gonna easily take out some ground. Uh, I think Fichki just unable to get a coordinated attack and I mean they just need two, they don't need one, so it's just so hard. I feel like they've kind of given up, I'm not seeing much pressure going on. That's what I feel like too, because like, otherwise they would have tried um, with multiple players attacking, but right now yeah. it's just so I mean, Winx and Flora, two plays, can they do anything? Pap and Immortal Hero are there to also support, and Mr. Vanko also spawns. Yeah, just... Yeah. Team Point is all they need to do, and they have been doing for the last three minutes or so. They've just went full defense. Um, mm -hmm. I mean, they just sent one person, and somebody just said GG, so I mean, it's over. Yeah, 50 seconds left. It is possible, but it's looking very unlikely. No. Mm, Stella, Mars not able to... Out. Mars gonna get taken out, team point is return. Might even get the third flag here. He's not gonna let that happen, he's not gonna let his clan... ...lose another flag. But yeah, yeah, I mean, I think he looks like a rep. So, it looks like both teams are going to be getting three points each from this game. It was a very intense game, especially the light format was very inter interesting. But, and honestly, team pointers need to figure out a way to do much better than they did in, in light. But, as they go into the playoff stage, but for now, the, it's going to be a tie in terms of Overall points. That's correct. Okay, so we're gonna pick winners quickly now, and then we'll we'll have another stream, guys, right after this one in about four minutes, and uh, join us for that one as well, with more chances to win promo codes and enjoy some esports. We have a new commentator today, um, so that's a surprise. You should. Check that out in the next stream. Right, so the three winners on your screens. Uh, event 542, Sunday, and Shut Up. So, congrats, guys. Sharp's been getting very lucky. He's won quite a few. Evans every, every other day. Mm -hmm.